Hey everybody, how we doing? Hey, Dave here. Hey, it was brought to my attention a day or two ago by a reliable source. And when I say a reliable source, uh, I do mean that. Uh, this fella and I have known each other somewhere between 10 and 15 years. I think closer to 15, but uh, he's a stand-up guy. He's a really good dude, uh, one of my good friends, uh, and he's a trainer. He doesn't strength train like I do, uh, but he works out for fitness and strength. I mean, not the way I do it. And he runs. So he watches my videos. I've got plenty of people who do watch my videos, excuse me. So he tells me the other day, that um, he's hearing people grumble and moan about how I don't put the camera close enough to the weights when I lift so people can't see the weights. In other words, it was an insinuation that I'm not lifting what I say I lift in these videos. So I'm gonna address that right now, all right? Almost, put it this way, since I've had this gym here in Centerburg, been 15 years now, I have always made it perfectly clear on my videos and to anyone else and my blogs that if you don't think I'm strong enough to move the weight I'm moving, you're more than welcome to come to this gym right here and watch me train or jump in and train with me. Now, I've had people take me up on the offer. My good friend, Mikey Carter, has came out and watched me lift. Colin King has came out and watched me lift. Tony Gruber, who's also 60 years old and very fit and is a strength trainer, he's came out and trained with me a few times. He's very strong too. Um, not to mention all the other arm wrestling training partners of all ages I've had in here. There's not a fake weight in this damn gym. I'm gonna tell you that right now. And if you think there is, I'm extending the invitation to you. I don't care who you are. If you're decent about it, you come up and knock on my door or give me a call and we'll set it up. You're more than welcome to come down in this gym, hands on, put your hands on the weight. You're more than welcome to watch me train. I'll even let you load the bar for me, dudes. So you can pick the weight up yourself and load them bars and that'll give you your little bit of workout, and I'll be able to rest in between sets. How about it? One thing I can't stand are haters. One thing I can't stand is people that talk behind other people's back negatively. I got no respect or love for that whatsoever. So I'm extending you to the, the invitation, and I'm talking about being decent. My wife lives here too. I ain't gonna be stupid unless you get stupid. But if you want to come and see what I'm lifting and see that these weights are real. Now, as far as me getting away from the weights so you can't read it, dude, my curling station is right there. My curling station is right there, three feet from me. And see this tripod right here? When I'm making a video, that tripod there holds the camera. When I'm curling at my curling station, that camera gets me to this tripod. This camera is about three feet from my curling station. It can't get no closer. It can't get no closer without it being right up on it and then you couldn't see it and then you would say, well, it's too close, we can't see what it is. I'm not concerned about what you can't see. And if you think I'm gonna have somebody come down here, right now, the tripods hold my camera. You think I'm gonna have a third party come down here or a second party, whatever, and hold my cameras, and before I load every plate, I'm gonna show them just to appease the haters and the back talkers? You got another thing coming, man. But I'm gonna tell you this, if you think I'm lying about the weight, please come and watch. Please come and watch. Because I will go as far as telling you this. You can, if I run into you on the street and you tell me that I'm lying, if you tell me that I'm, 
we're going to have an issue, and I bet I win, and I bet you lose. Now, I may have to take a ride to the county. That's okay. It's just simple as so. I'll be out in a week or two, in a day or two. Who knows? But I'm going to tell you right now, you want to come and watch me lift. You can touch the weights. You can count the weights. You can load the weights. You can even get over there and try to lift it with me, which you ain't going to do it. I don't care who you are. 25 to 65, come and watch what I'm doing. And I think you'll know then that uh, I am the real deal. These are real weights, and I am that strong. I've been doing this for 48 years now. This year marks the 48th year. When I turn 63 in August, That'll make my birthday, August 15th, when I started lifting weights, when I got my first iron weight set. I was 14 years old, 1971. This will mark 49 years. And when I say I've been lifting weights for 49 years, I don't mean a break. Yeah, I've skipped a workout or two, got the flu or something. But most of the time, I even work out when I'm sick. I just lower the weights and still have a workout. 48 years. A lot of you yahoos ain't even been alive for 48 years, and the ones that have hadn't done anything consistently in 48 years. I can tell you that right now. I can tell by looking at you. So, um, you think I'm lying to you. Give me a call. You be decent, I'll be decent. I'll set up a workout time Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, and Saturday afternoons. As always, 15 years I've been here, those are my workout days. And like the other people who've came, saw, and became believers, you can come and watch me lift, even jump in if you want to, but you'll walk out of here a believer, one way or another. Later, Gators.